Hello everyone, Brian here with Audio Plugin Deals. Um, I know some people have been having some issues with installing the content for the Memory V Synth, so I really wanted to go and try to help out with that. Um, I think the issue is coming from the actual sample tank folder location, and I personally did not own, own any products from IK Multimedia, and I did not have sample tank, so everything worked smoothly and flawlessly for me personally. So. I'm going to start with what I did. I just downloaded all of the files from the uh, website. You know, I entered the, I, you purchase from Audio Plugin Deals, you get the serial number and there are some instructions on what to do. It tells you to download Authorization Manager, Syntronic Free, and the Memory V Sound Folders Part 1 and Part 2. So then I go and install Syntronic. wait for that now find your VST plugin folder and install that'll take a little bit because it's got about a gigabyte or so of the free content so we wait for that da, 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 da. All right, uh, there we go. So Centronic Free installed Authorization Manager, and then go to the Memory V Part One. Extracting, extracting. This is where it's tripping people up, I believe. So I will go through where that default folder is for the sample tank content think I have enough tabs open all right agree so here it is Syntronic sound content will be installed in your master sample tank 3 folder I did not own sample tank I did not own, own anything from IK multimedia before this so this is where it is by default we're going to go into our C users or C or whatever your main operating system drive is for me it's C then we go to users public then down to documents and then IK multimedia right here sample tank 3 um, before I had nothing here this is just all by default so I think possibly maybe some of the issues would be um, some people installed sample tank 3 before and they may have not remembered where that default folder is so if you don't know if you have sample tank and you don't know where your um, folder is just search in your users function and excuse me your users folder and it should pop right up there now I go and install now also remember you have to install both parts they are 2.23 gigabytes 2.48 gigs so it's half and half there we go here install that have fun with that we wait for that boom agree again make sure it's the same folder install let's go to our authorization manager this is fun isn't it now next you will have to enter your username for the website I had mine automatically signed me in I have the serial number already copied to my clipboard paste and it goes right to it there's my serial number don't steal my copy if you didn't already download the content you have an option to download it right here so there everything was authorized correctly and I know some people have been going in here you load for look for Centronic load it up and also some people are saying they don't have all the content so I didn't have everything there at first I hit make sure you have that same folder again rescan instruments it should pop right up 
here there's the memory v this is the other stuff that was um included with the free thing now some people say they don't think they have all the content i mean there's not a massive am amount of presets here so to make sure you have the right amount of content again we're going to go to our users folder our sample tank folder sample tank three now let's go to samples make sure everything downloaded and installed correctly you highlight that and as you can see 5.14 gigabytes that is the correct amount and then with the free content a little bit under a gig so that's what I did I it would work flawlessly I did not own any IK multimedia products before so I think that is where the issue is popping up and you're just gonna have to make sure you know the location of your sample tank folder which again if you do not go ahead and do a search and it will search through all your stuff and find that folder for you and make sure you install your memory v content right there into that folder so i hope that helps just a bit um, if anyone has any more issues you know reach out to us also reach out to ik multimedia they're the experts at this um, obviously since it's their product but again i just hope that helps some people clarifies maybe a couple of things and let us know how that works out for you thanks for watching